Namaste students. Today our topic is add and subtract of mixed fraction. Question is add 3 4 by 9 to 1 by 3. These are mixed fraction. For mixed fraction first step you have to convert into improper fraction. How can we convert into improper fraction? First you want to multiply it and then add. For this, 9 3 is a 27, 27 plus 4, 31 by 9. How can we write? 9, 9 3 is a plus 4. So what is the answer? 31. For this, 3 2's are. So first write 3 here. 3 2's are. And then add 1. 3 2's are 6. 6 plus 1. 7 by 3. So from this we are getting 31 by 9 and 7 by 3. 31 by 9. 7 by 3. Now can we add this? No. Why? Because 9 and 3 we are having different denominators. So we have to convert it to same denominator that means like fraction. How can we convert? We want to take LCM for this denominator. LCM 9 3. For factorizing you have to take prime number 3. 3 3 is a 9. 1 3 is 3. Again, 3, 3, 1 is 3, 1. We are getting 1. So, now for LCM, 3, 3 is a 9. We have the LCM here, 9. So, in this sum, already we are having 9 in denominator. So, we want to change this alone. You keep it as it is, 31 by 9. For this, how can we change? 7, 3. First you have to multiply it in denominator. In which number we have to multiply? 3. Then only we can get 9. So same number should be multiplied by here also. 31 by 9. Here 7 3 is 21 divided by 9. We are having same denominator. Now we can easily add 31 plus 20, 1. 31 plus 21, 52 by 9. We are getting this. After simplifying, the final answer should always be expressed in the lowest form. But how can we reduce here? Directly we can't. Cancel it. So, if you are dividing means we can get simplest form. 9, 52. How many times 9 will come? 5 are 9, 5 are 45. Subtract 7. So, now we can write it simplest to form. This 5 should be right. Quotient should be right like this. 7 by 9. So, we are having the question 3, 4 by 9 and 2, 1 by 3. Answer is 5, 7 by 9. Next question, if 2, 1 by 3 is taken away from 5, what would be left? Here the question is, 2, 1 by 3 is taken away from 5, what would be left? Already we know that taken away, left are the keywords for subtraction, isn't it? So, 2, 1 by 3 is taken away from 5. 
So we want to write 5 here minus 2 1 by 3. We have whole number here. In this we have mixed fraction. So how can we subtract this? Let's see. First we want to convert this into improper fraction. So write 5 as it is. Change into improper. 3 2 is 6. 6 plus 1 7. 7 by 3. Whole number and improper fraction. Children, from this we don't have anything in denominator. So we can write it as in denominator 1. Minus 7 by 3. Here 1 and 3 are different denominators. So we can take LCM for this. 1 comma 3. Already 1 is having. So for prime factorization we will take 3. 1 we can write it as it is. Same way 1 3 is 3. We are getting 1 in last. So we want to stop here. What is the LCM for this? Yes, 3 alone. So, this is this LCM. We have to change this. 1, what number we have to multiply from this? 3. The same number should be multiplied here also. Minus 7 by 3. Here we can write 3 in common. 5 3 is a 15 minus 7. 15 minus 7 we get 8 by 3. After simplifying we have to reduce it into simplest form. So directly we can't cancel it. For division you have to write 3 here. This is a divisor. 8. How many 3? Yes. 3 2 is 6. Subtract 8 minus 6. 2. So we have to write 2. 2 by 3. Quotient should be here. And then 2, 2 by 3. This is the answer.